Hi everyone! This is a quick video to show you how to set the beginning and ending times for your song that is ready to be bounced. So first off what we're going to do is we are going to come up here to our playhead and we're going to switch this to the custom view. You can use some of the other views but this is the view that I prefer. So from here, the numbers we want to pay attention to are the bars, the playhead position bars. Here is your playhead, and then each, each node here is a bar. All right. So I'm going to go to just before where the music starts. If you want it to be closer than where it's automatically um, setting to, uh, you can hit Command right arrow and that will expand so you can get right up right before it. Okay, I'm going to go back, uh, zoom out a little bit here. And this number as you can see has changed. It's 1 space 4 space 2 space 201 is the final number. You can write that number down on a piece of paper with um, you know, it, just to have it on a piece of paper, or um, what I like to do is I like to keep it right here in the project so I can reference it in the future um, and everything's all in one place. So I'm going to call this the beginning, begin at 1 space 4 space 2 space 201. And now I'm going to go grab the ending. And the ending time uh, I'm going to come back into this window and I am going to scroll all the way to the end of my song. Dun, 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 dun. And the ending actually isn't right here because what I did already, which I'll do in another video, is I set an automation fade right here. So the fade is actually happening and ending the song a little bit before these tracks end. And where the little infinity db is right here, that's the actual ending of the song where I want it to end. So I'm going to write down the number that I see here in the playhead bars, and that's going to be 90 space 1 space 1 space 1. And it looks like there are more spaces here, but actually there's enough room here for three digits. Just like we had in the beginning of the song where it's going to be starting, that last number is a three digit number. So just wanted to clarify that there's only one space in between this one and the last one. Okay, so I'm going to come back into this window and I am going to uh, type the letter A to get rid of the automation view and I'm going to go back to the beginning of the song and scroll up so that I can see my tracks and the waveforms and I'm going to actually click done over here on my notepad because I'm finished with that and um, to watch your song play along uh, as you bounce you want to make sure that your playhead position here, your catch playhead button is selected. So from here I do one final save and then I do command B and that's going to open up my bounce window. I'm not going to do a wave file for this tutorial, we're just going to stick to bouncing an mp3. For my mono I'm going to keep this at 192 and for the stereo we're going to do 320. And I'll get into ID3 tags in another uh, tutorial, but for right now, let's just set the beginning and end times. So for the start time, I like to triple click in here and then start typing 1 space 4 space 2 space 201. Okay, so now you see why I, ha I kept that window open over there so that I can see it um, for typing in here in the bounce window. And then from here, just uh, type in your tab, just tab into the next window and that will automatically select it and we are going to type in 90 space 1 space 1 space 1 and that's going to be the end of the song. 
I'm going to keep the normalizing off because I like my mix. I don't want any normalizing happening. And um, also, I'm not going to filter any frequencies, and I want to uh, watch the bounce as it happens in real time. So from here, we'll go ahead and click OK, and we're done. Oh no, we're not done yet. That's right, we have to name it. <laughs> okay, so here, uh, I have already saved it before, obviously. So um, I am just going to call this one Z Crystal Snow Meditation 4. That way it won't replace the one that I already have there. Okay, let's go ahead and bounce. Mm -hmm. 